For a long time, this place has been considered to be a magical place. Certainly it's a place of mystery, of beauty. Perhaps a place where you might meet the Tilsteg, the fair folk. Now, in days gone by, in each village there was a wise man or a wise woman to whom people would go for advice. And there was a woman called Shaned in Pentra Ivan, and she was the wise woman of the village. People would go to her for her blessing on their marriage or on the birth of a new baby. And they would go to her to seek guidance and advice. And so it was that a young couple who lived in the village, Maya and Sam, went to see Shaned, for they had been married for four years and still no child had come to them. They went into the front room and there they sat and waited for Shaned. Sometimes she kept people waiting so long that they would fall asleep in the evening. Patiently they sat. They had brought her a little gift, an offering, a wooden box that Sam had carved. He was quite a craftsman. When she came at last into the room, they gave her the wooden box. She inspected it, seemed satisfied, and invited them to make some tea. Sam picked up three cups and wiped them with the tea towel. Then he wiped the little jug and filled it with milk from the urn outside. Meanwhile, Maya spooned three teaspoons of tea into the teapot and poured hot water from the kettle on, on the fire. Finally, they sat with their cups of tea. And Shamed said, to have a child, you must love one another. And I can see that you do. To have a child, you must have wisdom beyond your years. And though I cannot say if you have that wisdom, I can see that you are sensitive enough to know what is needed. Well, Sam, who had been a little skeptical about all this, was impressed that the woman knew what they had gone there for without them even saying. She then told them that they must make an offering to the Telchteg, an offering of something they had made themselves. And they must take that offering and place it outside Pentra Ivan burial mound. On this very stone, they may have placed that box. The box that Sam carved carefully out of wood and placed there as an offering. And sure enough, soon after, they had a child. And from that day, every year on the child's birthday, they made an offering. They made cakes and left them for the fair folk. And also one for Shaned in the village who had given them such good advice.